What's up guys, it's Shay and I'm back here doing another video. Today what I'm going to be doing is checking out the new update for S uh, FSRP Leon County. Uh, in the new updates, um, there's been a, if you go over to the minimap, there's landmarks and it shows all that cool stuff. It shows where the panics are, police panics. Also, they added uh, the um, campsites and stuff at the park ranger. So we're gonna go check that out really quickly. Now I recently, I recently just bought this game actually. So I'm lost though. Let me see this game. Um, the reason I bought it is because like the graphics look really well, and it's just like the interior. But uh, the thing with this new update, I noticed a lot of people are starting to press the panic button, and it gets kind of, gets kind of, dis gets kind of, um, what would you say, disturbing, because it just makes a weird noise and whatnot. Okay, I don't think I'm actually allowed to go back here though. I might have to change to civilian. So if I have to, go. which. Um, the only people allowed back in the park is civs, um, and the park rangers, and sometimes the, uh, state patrol. So, they- oh yeah, they're not gonna let me in. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna switch to, uh, civilian team, and I'll be right back. Alright, guys, I'm back, so, switch to civilian, and we're just gonna- Right up here on the left, we have the park ranger station. I'm already hearing gunshots. Okay. Sorry if I'm a bit laggy. I have to think I'm like that when I'm recording. So over here is the park ranger station. Can't go in there though. Oh, I'm not really sure what that leads to. But uh, this is another way to get into the park. So what we're going to do is go back to the main entrance. And what's really cool is that you have... Uh, tickets that you can buy. That's really cool. I hope I don't get pulled over if I was telling you the top. Alright, so what you do is you pull up right to this one right here. And, uh, oh, they are very busy. So if you don't have a pass, what you would do is you see this right here, you click one day, two day, or five day pass. Unfortunately, it's not a real day, so they're cheap. And let me click on this thing right here. And it's kind of being shot at for no reason. What are they doing? They, that's what I don't like about this game. There are very little people who play it, and the people who play it are just not very, not very serious. On your right here, we have the campsite and marina really cool uh, okay I like the, the forest look and everything there's the campsites there's actually a lot of tents over here which would make for some very good role playing but the only thing I don't like about this game so far is the lack of people that play it so you can go back there there's tents and everything there's tents everywhere Um, by the way, the Park Ranger Pass is 300 Robux, and, uh, to be honest, uh, I don't know if it's kind of worth it or not, because, um, yeah, they get to control the park and whatnot, just the jurisdiction, but, um, I don't, they can't really come out of the park, and there are some pretty cool vehicles that you get to deliveries and stuff. And uh, the outfit is pretty cool, but I mean it's up to you guys. Oh, uh, okay. Oh yeah, this goes to the marina over here. We we'll go check this out really quickly. Like I said, my graphics are on low right now, so it's gonna be it's not gonna look as good as some of you guys' graphics probably. 
So over there is just some parking. I wish I could have explored this during the day. So we have uh, this, uh, is it an ocean or a lake? I don't know. Usually marinas are on lakes, so. Uh, over there is like a, you can go in there, there's like a grill and stuff. There's legit like a boat ramp there and uh, a dock, which would be pretty cool if they added boats. Um, I will be doing, they have updates coming, they have another update in December coming, and then they have some next year, January, February, I will be reviewing those, um, updates. So, let's see, is there anything else? Let's go to the, I forget what else was over here. I kept going straight. Maybe the park hours are closed. Maybe that's why they were shooting at me. That's, mm, that's the only reason I can think of. That actually would kind of make sense, but then again, it doesn't make sense because if the park closes, why is there campsite? Oh, okay, there's the cabins, which is really cool. It'd be kind of cool if you could rent them. So let's see. Uh, it's not very big, it's just that it just loops around. I don't think you can go inside of them, can you? I have no idea, I haven't tried, but... You guys can try it for yourself. I'm trying to make this video pretty short. So yeah, pretty nice. Alright, now straight over here... Uh, I forget what's down here. I think it's, um, there is a way where you can... Um, hop on the interstate from inside the park, I think. I don't know. You can access the interstate from within the park. So I'm, okay, that's just like an off-road area. So is this. Just an off-road area that circles around down here. And the, over there is the interstate, I believe. Which is really cool. I like how this lake goes all around. Really cool. So I think that's pretty much it for the update. Um, I forgot what else they might have added. Um, like I said, I went over this jurisdictions and whatnot. And let's see, there also is a new siren box. I don't know. I did not show you that guy. I did not show that, but nothing too special. It's kind of like the uh, kind of like one of the a different game. I don't know. I don't know. I'm running out of things to say. But uh, I'm gonna try to get out here without getting shot. And uh, that's pretty much it for this um, uh, FSRP uh, Ranger update. Or Park Ranger update. And uh, let me know if you guys like it in the comment section down below. And uh, I'll see you guys later.